What is going on, everybody? It's a brand new week. We have tons of really fun rips for you this week, but we're starting it off with a product that I've always had a lot of luck with, Heritage Baseball Mega Box. And as always, I try to pick the most dinged up damaged box. For some reason, it has always been a good omen whenever I've done it. So I'm going to try to do it more. But let's get into it. Rookie class looking solid so far. Evan Carter is a beast. You got, man, you got a lot of really good guys in this class. But of course, we're looking for Ellie De La Cruz. That's the person I want, the person that has eluded me. But today we're going to hit him. And these mega boxes always come with, well, the Walmart ones come with the really cool looking blue sparkle parallels. And there's batting leaders, Luis Arise, and uh, we know the <laughs> no Marlins player is going to have an insert next year. They all suck. We have a Joey Weimer uh, short print. And a Tristan Casas again. I'm I. This set is always one of the most confusing's with the short prints and the parallels and the inserts. So if I skip over something, you guys got to help me. I think that's just a short print. All right, we got one of our blue sparkles. And knowing how a, a color match would go crazy with Evan Carter. Oh, we got something here. We got a Chrome card. Before that, to five seventy five. Carlos Correa. We gladly take those. And hold on, let's just get through this first. A Padre. Hi Song Kim is our first of the blue sparkles, but the Correa is the better card for sure. Hard to see, but it does. It's like right on the border of all the colors there, so it's a little tough to see, but that is to 575 Carlos Correa. Numbered card. Get that up there. And we continue. Furman. Otani is in this with his Dodgers jersey. Still cool to see that. Still pretty surreal. Cortez. We get one of these flashbacks. One of the first commercially successful personal computers. Don't care. <laughs> Don't care. Um, shout out to uh, Ted Kaczynski. I bet he would burn that card if he were still alive. But anyway, Rosario, we get a, I think this is, yeah, this is a white border short print. Yeah, it even says it up there. White border, Blake Rutherford, a rookie white border. I don't know how rare those are, but I mean, it's some kind of variation type thing. So we sleeve it. Can't hurt. Let's keep it moving. Josh Young. Lofton. Jesus Lazardo. Luis Robert. Abbott and Juan Soto of the Yankees playing. Playing at an MVP level is Juan Soto. The Yankees. I mean, I don't like the Yankees, but it feels like baseball is better when the Yankees are competitive. Trick Bailey. Montefusco. Oh, we get a Gunner Hen Gunner Henderson is I guess is unless that's a variation. I guess Gunner Henderson is a short printed player in this set. That's interesting. Didn't know that. Till now I do. And we get Volpe, who's playing out of his mind, and a Braxton Garrett. I mean, any Mar any Marlins card you get, just, just throw it in the garbage. <laughs> just get rid of that thing. It's, it's occupying space that another card could be occupying. Yogi Berra. 
Basabi, Basabe, Justin Steele, and Blake Rutherford. So we still got another blue sparkle in here. I hope it's a rookie. Hope we could get one rookie. But I wonder what the Gunnar Henderson short print is selling for. Because it's pretty cool. Dubon. Like, yeah, this guy, I get him being a short print. But Gunnar Henderson with his gold cup. I don't know. Is it is it an honor if you're a short printed player? Or is that disrespectful? Grossman. Get yeah, Manny Machado, Amaya. I get. I guess it's kind of an honor. But okay, still waiting on that last blue sparkle, and we haven't really hit any of the big rookies yet. Suzuki, World Series. So, yeah, still no none of the uh, bigger rookies in the set. It is such a loaded rookie class. Like, I cannot wait for Topps Chrome. There's a good one. Rafaela. He's pretty good. Canzone. Adelie Rutschman. Jose Rodriguez. Some of these guys used way thicker pens or just pressed harder than the other ones. I don't know how that dude got. Like, the, he, probably, he probably used, like... The whole entire pen on that one signature. Just holding it like, you know, like a fist. Just jabbing the card. There we got Adam Frazier. And RBI leaders. All right, three. This will be the final blue sparkle. Can we get a good one? New Age Performers. And I do love the base and yeah, a brewer. Sal Frelick. I think he's actually okay. And it is a rookie, so I you know I asked for a rookie. And we got one. Cards look awesome. I mean when you compare I think the the Target Heritage Mega Boxes are like red borders. They look like crap. They are nothing special. I mean they'll go pretty hard if you hit a Ellie De La Cruz one. Just for the red on red, but these ones just, I think, look so much better. Like, it's not even worth getting the Target one when you could get the Walmart one. Here we go, the last pack. Pretty, you know, mid-box, nothing great. Oh, we get, hey, Baltimore Oriole. And a lot, okay, a lot going on here. I don't know why that card's upside down. We get a Baltimore Oriole, Oriole card. I don't know what this is, but love the look of the Oriole. We get a 200th win for Kershaw and Johnny DeLuca. There you have it, everybody. Heritage Mega Box. Not the most exciting set, but still some really cool cars and cool hits out of this. So I'll get some comps. And yes, please let me know in the comments if I missed something while I was opening this. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.